Raymond Blanchard. Raymond Blanchard was a man who had always loved life. He grew up in California, surrounded by friends and family, and always appreciated the simple pleasures in life. But as he got older, he felt a need for a change of pace, a new adventure to pursue. And so, he decided to move to Nanawale, a small town on the big island of Hawaii. As he settled into his new home, a beautiful house perched on a hill overlooking the ocean, Raymond was struck by the beauty and serenity of his surroundings. He spent his days exploring the island, meeting new people, and soaking up the warmth and energy of Hawaii. But there was one thing that made Raymond's new home truly special. The house he had bought had been built by Gideon, a local craftsman who had a reputation for creating some of the most breathtaking homes on the island. Gideon had put his heart and soul into the house, using only the finest materials and paying attention to every detail, from the hand-carved wooden doors to the intricate tile work in the kitchen. Raymond was in awe of the beauty and craftsmanship of the house, and he knew that he had found something truly special. He loved the way the light filtered through the windows in the morning, the sound of the waves crashing against the shore in the distance, and the way the breeze always seemed to carry the scent of tropical flowers. As he settled into his new life, Raymond realized that his love for people and appreciation of life had only grown stronger. He made friends with the locals, learned to surf, and spent his evenings sharing stories and laughter with new acquaintances. But it wasn't just the people and the lifestyle that inspired Raymond. It was the house itself, with its stunning architecture and attention to detail. He knew that he was living in a work of art, and he felt a sense of pride and gratitude every time he walked through its doors. Over time, Raymond began to realize that his love for life and his appreciation for beauty and craftsmanship had become intertwined. He saw the beauty in the world around him, and he wanted to share that beauty with others. And so, he began to invite friends and family to visit him in Hawaii, to share in the wonder of his new home and the beauty of the island. He hosted parties and gatherings, and every time someone walked through the door of his house, they were struck by its magnificence. Through his love of life, his appreciation of beauty, and his commitment to sharing both with others, Raymond Blanchard had created a home that was more than just a place to live. It was a work of art, a testament to the power of passion and creativity, and an inspiration to all who were lucky enough to experience it.